Hey guys, we're back with August Japan Crate and we're gonna eat it for you. I forgot to tell you guys uh, in the unboxing last time we had one more thing. This is Haichu Shizuoka Crown Melon. So it's like a honeydew, I think. Um, so that's in the crate as well. So let's start off, I wanna start with the popcorn. So this was the uh, noodle broth based flavored popcorn. Let's give that a shot. Hey buddy, we got some popcorn. You like popcorn. Yeah, you love popcorn. Mmm. It's sweet, but it's got like a salty beef flavor. This is very delicious. It's definitely like kind of like a beef ramen type flavor. That's awesome. I think the United States needs to step up its game in its popcorn flavors. I love that. Uh, let's see, let's try our tiny bouquet seaweed. So this is like, I've had these before, I think. Uh, let's see. I'm really bad at opening these. Why are you looking over here? Hmm? Food's over here. Hi. Oh, these are cute. I've had bigger versions of these. So these are about half the size of the regular version. So these are like a harder type rice cracker. Mmm. So they're a dense rice cracker. And you can like see like there's seaweed and there's like a little brown on it. So it's like a little, almost like a soy sauce type seaweed flavor. I love those. Not enough for this one. This one's the uh, rice crackers with French dressing flavor on it. So these are gonna be a different shape as well. So these are like a little twisty flavor, or twisty shape. They don't have a scent to it. Mm. Not really getting too much of a French dressing flavor, it's just more like salty. Let's try another one. Mm. I don't, yeah, I definitely don't taste a French dressing flavor. It just tastes like a salted rice cracker. Um, still good though. I definitely love the crunchy texture. It's light. Um, it's a fun snack. I just don't get the flavor, but still good. Alright, let's try the seven stick milk cream. So this should be um, this should be like a wafer with cream inside, and one side is definitely smushed. So I'm gonna try and open it with the not smushed side, and not make a mess everywhere. Oh, this is gonna make a mess everywhere because they're all squished. Okay, let's see. Oh, that's terrible. All right, this is the only not squished one in the pack. If you guys can see. You can kind of see they're all, a couple of them are flattened completely and the rest are crushed and broken. So let's give this a shot. So it's hollow inside. And there was cream in the bite that I took. It's a very sweet, like milky vanilla type flavored cream. It's pretty good. Um, the rest of those I'm just gonna have to like eat right out of the package because they're so squished. Oh man, that's funny. Alright, so let's try our grape gummies next. This is a grape gummy. If it's what I think it is, it's gonna be super soft and delicious. Oh yeah, you can smell it right from opening the package. A strong grape flavor. Mmm. Alright, not as soft as I thought it was gonna be. He is so not interested in this grape. But... It's got that more natural grape flavor, which I like. I mean, I love artificial grape, but I love the natural flavor grape too. So it tastes kind of like a Concord grape. All right, let's try our our chocolate strawberry poochie poochie. So that's the sound it like makes when you're popping them out. Let's see if I can taste the strawberry through the chocolate. Mm-hmm. You can definitely taste the strawberry. It's an artificial strawberry flavor. But it's good. It's a cute little candy. And again, this is like a little fortune telling game. Um, I don't know how it works, but it's delicious candy nonetheless. Alright, let's try our 
Oh, let's go to these chips. I almost forgot about those. So the seaweed and salt chip star. So it's in a like a Pringles type container, but it's also sealed on the inside here as well. So they're extra fresh. And you can see there's a lot of green uh, in that potato chip, and that's the seaweed. Mm. So these taste very much just like a regular a regular chip. Now you're interested? Yeah, you probably like these too. This tastes very much like a regular chip with a light seaweed flavor. Mm. So good. If I had to pick my favorite potato chip so far, it'd be this one. Very delicious. All right, now let's move on to our Haichu Shizuoka Crown Melon. I'm guessing this is going to taste very much like a honeydew. And if you've ever had Haichu before, you'd know this is like it doesn't stick to your teeth. So I'm just going to take a little bite. So it's light green on the outside, I don't know if you can see that, and it's white on the center. Some of them are just completely white. Uh, it smells wonderful, doesn't it? You like melon. One of Kato's favorite foods is watermelon. Mmm. I'm not a huge fan of honeydew or cantaloupe, but this is delicious. I know. It is very delicious. It's got a wonderfully strong melon flavor to it. I like that a lot. If I had to pick a melon thing, that would be it. So I just want to show you the balloon pop thing. I'm not going to eat it because again, it takes a long time to eat hard candy. But So it's a little balloon shaped pop. You're supposed to stick it on your finger, wiggle it around. It's supposed to be fun for everyone. But uh, it's definitely cute. And this is strawberry flavored. And I'll get to that later. Again, this is the gum that you can mix uh, in different flavors. Uh, there's like a little chart on the back, if you guys can see that. It tells you which flavors you can mix to create what, and it's really cool. I'll be doing that later as well. And again, this is the hard candies, strawberry and uh, blueberry flavor with vitamin A. Again, it's very hard to eat hard candies for you guys because it takes so long. But let's at least see what the toy is in these ramen flavor whistles. So, let's see if I can show you guys how to whistle with these here. See, very loud, very loud whistle. Yes, did that interest you? Of course it did. Let's see what we got for our little toy here on our box. These are very tiny toys, so... Okay, I got a little cute ring with, um, looks like Hello Kitty, maybe? It's very small plastic ring, so if you have small children or pets, keep it away from them, because they can swallow these easily. So, we'll put you back in the box. Alright, now let's get to our drink, guys. This is my, the most exciting one that I've wanted to try. This is the Kiwi Fanta with vitamin E. Let's give it a shot. <gasps> Did you like that sound? Hmm? How does it smell? It smells good? It smells like kiwis. Oh, that's delicious. That tastes a lot like a kiwi. Mmm, I've never had kiwi soda before, but that is delicious. If you can get your hands on it, I recommend it. And plus the fact that it's got vitamin E, that's pretty cool. I've never had a soda with vitamins in it before. Alright guys, that has been August's Japan Crate Tasting. Stay tuned for September's, which is going to be cool because it's going to feature stuff picked out by Tony Hawk himself. We will see you next month, guys. Bye!